In this tutorial, we're going to look at how to create a custom banner and customize your home page in Blackboard. We're going to be using Photoshop, and I've first started out by creating a new project by going to File, New, and I created it in a size of 800 width and a height of 175. I'm using an RGB color space which is for use with the anything that's going to be out on the web and I have a resolution of 72 which will be sufficient for this project and I named my project I named it banner I'm gonna go ahead back to my original project which I've already created a couple elements here I just wanted to go ahead and get started but I put in a graphic where I'm gonna be placing some titling and so forth the course name I think I'm gonna put here and I'm gonna add some other elements and so I want to go ahead and show you how to do that I went out to the internet and, and just got a couple of images and I've, I've opened those in Photoshop what I'm gonna do is grab the move tool in Photoshop and just bring those over to my project you'll see how that'll just pull in here I can also adjust the size if I don't like the size and so forth. But I'm going to show you something about that in just a moment with this other file. So I'm going to bring this one in and put it there. And I'm going to, if you'll notice over here, it created its own layer. And I'm going to drag this particular layer to the bottom. So now then that is the bottom layer. So what I'm going to do now is grab my eraser tool. I'm just going to kind of flush that out, but not on that particular layer. I want to undo that layer and choose the layer that I'm going to erase a little bit. I'm just going to erase some of this around here. And now I notice that I have a little blank area here, so I'm going to go back to the layer with the background, and I'm going to go to Edit, Transform, Scale. So I'm going to bring that all the way across so that reaches all the way across for my background. Okay, well I'm now ready to go ahead and put a little bit of titling here. So I'm going to go ahead and get the text tool. New media. 101. And I'm going to move that over so it shows up right there in my little iPhone. I can also put some other text information right here. Maybe I want to put uh, Fall 2010. And I can also add some effects to that layer. I'm going to go over to my palette with the layer selected that says Fall 2010. Select the effects. I'm going to put a stroke on there. I'm going to change the color. I think I'll go with a maybe I'll choose this orange right here that'll work and I'm gonna change the size of the stroke about, about like that okay let's put a little drop shadow there as well I'll change my drop shadow just a little bit by the distance and click OK alright so we have a basic banner go to file save as and we're going to save this as a jpeg file okay so it's saving as banner jpeg okay now in the next section of the tutorial i'm going to be showing you how to insert this and customize your blackboard page in your blackboard course under the Build tab, choose the Page Options. Choose Edit Header, and your HTML editor will show up in your pop-up window, and select the icon for Insert Image. Click File to Browse or Upload Image, and we're going to go to My Computer, and I will find Banner and Open. click OK and I'm going to center that banner and 
click save now you've learned how to insert a banner I'm also going to show you how to customize your page display by changing the color a little bit so I'm gonna select a color click select and apply that's how you insert a banner and change the color background of your blackboard course good luck